Hi, I'm Zayn Ackerman and I'm in fourth grade. Hi, I'm Ava Schwartz and I'm in fourth grade. Hi, I'm Danielle O'Connor and I'm in third grade. Hi, I'm Lance Mader and I'm in fourth grade. Hi, I'm Keon Shaw and I'm in fourth grade. We explored about the cargo process by watching videos about the shipping industry. We really liked the, the video that showed us the inside of a cargo ship. We discussed our experiences and the ways we saw cargo ship from one place to another. We also learned the different ways of the spike program, including scratch programming. Several of, several of us built and programmed a pinball machine. We found out robots are taking over a lot of repeated human tasks. Those jobs are being replaced by jobs that create, maintain, and program the robots. Danielle will tell you about how packages are processed. We learned how packages are processed in delivery centers or factories. Sorting systems can scan and sort packages more quickly than by hand. Warehouses organize the packages to be able to find them back more easily. We also, also explored the different ways cargo is transported. Almost every piece of cargo is transported on a truck and a cargo ship. Some cargo is transported on trains and planes. The last mile of, of cargo delivery can be completed by I, trucks, walking, delivery people, scooters, or drones. Zane will tell you about package delivery process and last mile ship. Your package usually starts at a factory. A ship, truck, plane, or combination of transportation methods takes it to a warehouse or distribution center. A truck or plane make it to the center of the reseller. Finally, it is delivered to its final destination by one of the last mile delivery methods. The last mile delivery is one of the most expensive um, part of the delivery process. It is currently done by a delivery driver dropping off a package at the destination. Com companies are exploring different ways to make it more efficient like using automated trucks, drones, and robots. Now Lance will show off our model. The cargo starts from a plane or ship which is controlled by the tower. Then the claw moves the, the cargo into the factory, which gets sorted and turned into goods. Then the truck can come and pick up and go into the neighborhood, or the train could be sh could go out and ship it. Then this is our neighborhood, and we made someone delivering it. And now Ava will explain how our program works. We created our program using the Spike Essential software. We chose to use the word box for our program. This is the first year we have used the Spike program. We programmed our sorting machine to sort the packages by color. We used the color sensor to detect what color package is in there. The color detected determines which event is run. There is a light blue event and a dark blue event. They both run the motor counterclockwise to push the package in the blue side and turn the light on top of the computer blue. We only needed one event for the green color. When the green package is detected, it turns the motor clockwise to push the package into the green side and turn the light on the top of the computer green. The package goes through the sorter that isn't blue or green. It turns the light red because it isn't the right color package. Now, Kian will close with how we shared. We shared what we learned by creating a video and sending it to the festival. We posted our video on YouTube to share with friends and family. We showed our model and our poster to our families. We also share, shared with our classmates. Thank you for watching our video.